those 35 people that were named in the case. But now, with the class-wide certification, what that does is converts it into a class action lawsuit. So this will protect, potentially, everybody in the Navy who has requested a religious accommodation from the military vaccine mandate. And I think this is part of the reason why. People who are serving in the military want to know that the government, that the United States military has their back. If they're going to put their lives on the line to defend this country and defend our freedom, the very least we can do is ensure that they don't lose the very freedoms that they're protecting. But that's not happening right now. We have to have that in a free country if we're going to continue to be the nation that we've always known as the United States. They're using it as a way of punishing them, which is unconstitutional and it's illegal. When you serve in the military, you give up some of your freedom, some of your autonomy. You don't give up your religious freedom.